egg is what they live inside of. And you can tell that it was going to be going bad. I mean, this stuff is usually liquid inside. At least that's what I understand. It's hard to wake this sleepy lizard up. Especially in Foxy. Hello! Ha <laughs> Aloha! Aloha! We're cutting open a snake egg today. Come on in close, wetsuit boy. We've got a fly in the room is trying to drive me insane. And it's gonna, it's probably gonna... So, so we did one of these videos about a year ago, and so before we cut open this egg right here, I just wanted to put a couple of little facts out there, because there was a lot of confusion in the last one, like, some people were saying, it's, it's animal abuse, like, how could you possibly do that? Just to be perfectly, absolutely clear, this egg is dead, deceased, and mom even knew it. If you watched a few videos ago, this egg got kicked out by mom out of her clutch, out of her coils, because she's like, that egg's gonna go bad. She knew it. I didn't know it by looking at it. By looking at the egg, for all intents and purposes, I thought it was a good egg, that she just was a bad mom and didn't, didn't really do a good job of getting them all inside of the clutch to incubate. But, turns out she knows way better than we do, and this egg died. And how you can tell is because it's getting this blue color this mold is happening on it and it's just looking really bad and then there's the smell which you can't smell through the camera how does it smell boys horrible it's horrible ew oh, don't do that again yeah so this this egg is dead this is not animal abuse in fact i don't even cut open egg a lot of people cut open eggs uh at day 55 just to kind of see what's going on with the egg and i don't really have a problem with people doing that i i honestly don't care whatsoever if people do that or not that's to me that's their own choice i don't like to do it because it's then you just have to wait for the snake to crawl out and it's like i feel like i'd be torturing myself just cut the egg open see what it is and then i have to sit there and wait for it to crawl out of the egg anyways i let the eggs pip naturally here just because that's a personal choice and you really need to stop kicking that table okay you're just shaking the entire table all right yeah we're all a little crazy right now it's it's uh so anyway, I thought that we'd cut this egg open for you guys so you can see what's inside. I was about to go just put it into, uh, feed it to the tegu, or I was thinking about the, the compost pile, but then I remembered, hey, last time this was our most viewed video ever, so why not do it again? And with the clarification of, it's dead already, but we're going to see what's inside. You ready? Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Brand new razor blade, so it should cut open nice and easy. Yeah. No. I can't smell it. Oh, you will. Oh my god. And you won't like it. There we go. And there's stuff oozing out. It's horrible and disgusting. Oh. There we go. Well, that's the next snake. Oof. The devil looks like a snake. Yeah, it looks like a snake, right? And it was sitting right there on top. And we had it on top just in case it was going to be good. But obviously it was not good. You can see there. Give you guys a little closer look at... And the egg is their brain. The egg is their brain? No, not, not quite. The egg is definitely not their brain. The egg is what they live inside of. And you could tell that it was going bad. I mean, this stuff is usually liquid inside. At least that's what I understand. I've never cut open an egg that was this early along. Uh, to, I but I, I'm almost positive this stuff stays liquid if it's a good egg. And it's all coagulated here because this egg had gone bad. And the snake died before it ever got a chance to really form. And Yeah, disgusting. Um, I'll move this aside here so you can kind of see the, the eyeball there. I want to get a view of it. A good view. One second, my guy. I'm going to give the people here a good view of it. Nice and close up on that thing so you guys can get a real good tight shot and see exactly what's happening here. Ugh. It's just... It's... It's unfortunate when a snake doesn't make it, man. It really really is because we we like to see it. as many snakes hash out healthy as possible but it is also very interesting to see a snake well before it's formed in the egg i mean this is 
for all intents and purposes, a lot like what we look like inside the womb when we're still forming. We're just all kind of curled up and not much going on, but a spine and an eye and some some forms, some sort of forming thing. It's just, uh, oh man, how's that smell treating you guys? Pretty good. Well, that's it. That's what's inside of a snake egg. If you've never seen it before, one that dies early. This is probably. Well, this was essentially just like a day along in, uh, in... I definitely want to see Look it. at Sangria doing that silly thing. <laughs> Sangria is a silly, silly I biscuit. I do want to see a better view, I guess. Oh, you want to see it better? Here. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Looks like it is. Smell as strong as you can. You take an alien with a tail. It does look like an alien with a tail. You're right. See that little black dot? Go like this? I do. It does look like an alien to me. What's so funny? Okay. All right. You got a case of the sillies. All right. We're out of here. Okay. I'm going to go wash my hands off. You better. I'm going to turn those hands into a smoothie and jump in outside. <laughs> what if we blend up a dead egg snake? Ew. Then you would have to eat it. <laughs> no way. And you need to clean up the table. Yeah, it's pretty gross. Yeah, I do not want to smell it again. Do you guys want to see if uh, Roxanne wants to eat that egg? Uh, sure. <laughs> technically, that egg is disgusting, right? You said yes. that twice. Yes, technically, that snake egg is disgusting. That's the technical term said, for it. You said that twice just the first time you weren't on film. Uh, Alright, so Roxanne Artegu is a omnivore. So she eats everything. So banana peels. You banana peels. Yeah. Roxanne. Roxanne's sweet. It's hard to wake a sleepy lizard up. Especially Roxanne. Yeah, she doesn't even know it's Roxanne! Are you alive? Hello? Are you sleeping? Yeah. I got food for you. Remember she you might want to wake up for this. It's a tasty treat. Remember she's the sleepiest lizard in the world. Roxanne. Roxanne. Wake up, wake up. The movie is good. Oh. Oh. Woo. Oh, she's just sleeping. Mm, yeah. Look. I brought you a treat. I think that she just doesn't want the she she thinks it's just as disgusting as we do apparently. <laughs> Try Jerry. Jerry's too small to eat that. I guess that is like the size of Jerry. Hey Noah. What? What do you know? I know. Eggs. What about eggs? There's a bunch of eggs, human eggs, um, and the humans get live birth. A human, okay, a kid, a baby is half sperm, half egg. If sperm gets to the egg, they start to create a baby. Lizard eggs, they just lay them and they hatch. I'm pretty sure that lizard, that some lizards don't have to mate to lay eggs and there's mammal eggs a couple mammal eggs bird eggs reptile eggs fish eggs and um that's pretty much all the eggs i can think of 
Okay, mister, I need my turn real badly, real badly, as fast as you possibly can. Right. Come here. Come no, on. No, no, Come no, on, no, you no. wanted this. What do you know? I know. Dad, something smells disgusting, and I don't want to smell it, and that's why I'm out here. That's all I know. <laughs> it's that egg. I'm out of here. It's a disgusting. <laughs> I'm out of this place. <laughs> we are ready to do it. Everybody's rocking their new wetsuits today over here. Hey T. Hey T, can we see your new wetsuit? What'd you do to your face? Hey, Leia Moon. I'm collecting rocks. You're, collect, you're collecting rocks? Yeah. What kind of rocks? Um, these kind of rocks. <laughs> what are you in Greek, Well. All right, you guys have a great day. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Bye.